What is the most abundant bioresource produced on the planet? Cellulosic biomass. Some cellulosic biomass comes from plant matter that is left over from agricultural and forestry operations, including tree and plant residue, the leaves, stalks, and cobs of corn left in a field after harvest, and sugarcane bagasse, the fibrous residue that remains after the stalks are crushed to extract their juice. All of these are used in the manufacture of biofuel fuel produced from renewable resources, to power vehicles now and planes and ships in the future. There are several methods used to create the fuel. During gasification, biomass is exposed to oxygen and steam under high temperature and pressure. Chemical reactions change the biomass into waste and syngas. Syngas, or synthetic gas, can be mixed with regular jet fuel to help power planes. But first, the syngas must be cleaned to remove any unwanted or reactive compounds. Cracking is a process to break down large complex molecules such as tar, critical for making the syngas compatible with internal combustion engines. Hydrothermal liquefaction converts the biomass into oil sometimes called bio-oil or bio-crude, by applying heat and high pressure in water tanks for long periods of time. This breaks down the plant's complex structure into mainly liquid components for further processing. Biomass is renewable because it is derived from crops that are harvested annually. Fuels made from biomass are safer and cleaner than fossil fuels, creating far less harmful emissions during processing and combustion. These include ethanol, methanol, and plant-based diesel fuels. And because they are mainly produced from inedible leftovers, the planet's edible food supply is not disrupted. <laughs>